Well, sure, you wear progressives in your everyday glasses, but you definitely don't need them in your sunglasses, right? Thank you so much for joining me. As always, I'm Eyeglass Tyler. Welcome again to my home. Please make yourself comfortable. We're talking progressive lenses in sunglasses, and this is a question that comes up a fair amount, and there are a lot of differing opinions, so I thought I'd talk about it. And I thought I'd do so by explaining first what progressives are. You probably already know, but I'm here, so why not? I'll give a little insight about buying progressives online. I work at Sport RX, so I might have some interesting insight there. I'm gonna talk when it's a good idea, when it's a bad idea to do progressives in sunglasses, and then I'll end with a little tip on buying progressives. So enough mincing words, let's just jump into it. Okay, so what are progressives? Like I said, you probably already know. You're probably here because you wear them and you're trying to decide if you should also get them in your sunglasses, so that makes sense. Also, we've done a video on this exact topic where I dig deeper and give you more information on it. I'll just do a quick overview because why not? So it is a multifocal lens. It gives you your distance correction, your reading correction, and as your eye scrolls down the lens, everything in between, and there are no lines to be contrasted between a line bifocal or a line trifocal where you have a distinct line and distinct segment. There you go, brief overview. Now, when it comes to buying progressives online, this is obviously an important part to us because we are SportRx, we are an e-commerce optical company. And so you wanna make sure that you are buying from a reliable source when you are investing this kind of money. Progressives are never cheap. There's no way around it, unfortunately. And so you wanna make sure that you're not just looking for the cheapest option because you're gonna get what you pay for. That's just the world we live in. And it probably will not match up with your expectations or your needs. And so I recommend getting the better designs for sure. And when it comes to SportRx, we have a really good method of determining your segment placement based on your frame and prescription combination. So you don't have to worry about getting it wrong when it comes to us. We also back it up with a pretty hefty, fantastic guarantee. So no stress when you're buying from SportRx. Now, when is it a good idea to get progressives in your sunglasses? Well, I think first and foremost, your everyday pair, the pair that you probably are going to be wearing the most. I think you would benefit and like the convenience factor of being able to see something up close, especially your cell phone, maybe reading something for a short moment. You're going to like having that there. When it comes to sport applications, endurance sports where near vision or intermediate vision is important. We're talking cycling with your cycling computer, uh, you know, running, hiking, those sorts of things where you would have a moment where it would make sense to be able to see something up close without having to have a second pair on you. Uh, motorcycle use is also a good idea because again, you have those displays, your speedometer, everything that you want to be able to see that otherwise you wouldn't be able to see. So progressives would be a good idea. Okay, so when is it a bad idea to get progressives in your sunglasses? In my opinion, ball sports. I think just about every ball sport doesn't really make sense. You probably understand progressives and know what it's like to wear them. And so you can understand that with a fast moving ball, you're trying to track and you understand that you need to be in the right area of the lens in the right place in the set. You don't wanna to have to figure where that is when you're trying to hit a ball or catch a ball, right? It doesn't make sense. And there's not a lot of benefit to it anyway. So I think you should skip it there. There is a ball sport. There's a little bit of contention around and that is golf. A lot of people think that progressives are great for golf and it, it might be, and it just depends on the person. Some people love them and would swear by them. My opinion is that when you practice a proper swing, you're keeping your chin up. That means you're looking through that magnified portion and the ball isn't clear. And you only really need that reading area when you're doing the scorecard anyway. So why not just have a pair of readers on the bag or in the cart and then just focus on distance only? I don't know, makes sense to me. Now for my tip on buying progressives, whether it be online or in person, I think as I alluded to a bit earlier, it's always the best idea to go with the better to best digital progressive design that is available to you. I think it just makes sense. They are better because it minimizes distortion, gives you the widest field of view possible and just makes your overall experience better. I think it's totally worth it, especially if you're talking about a sport or wrap frame design or an oversized larger lens, it's gonna make a huge difference in your overall quality of life and just vision. It's just gonna be worth it. I think it's a good idea. 
pretty well covers what I think is important to know when you're considering progressive lenses in your sunglasses. Hopefully, after my little tips on buying progressives online or just in general, my little when it's a good idea, bad idea segments there, you have a better idea of what's right for you and what you should be doing for your particular pair. I also want to make a note that thanks to our See Better guarantee, whenever you buy from SportRx, you never have to worry about getting something that isn't right or doesn't work for you. Just get back to us within 45 days and we'll take care of you. Also, we have opticians that would love to help you through that process to get it right the first time. So reach out to us. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully this was interesting or valuable. If so, throw us a like. I would love that. We have relevant videos you can check out there. If you subscribe, you're going to hear about those videos first. I promise. We also have good content on our social media outlets, and I would encourage you to check us out there too, at SportRx.